YSK when buying from a salesperson, hide your high-paying job title to avoid being upsold. So, I used to work in the furniture industry. And let me tell you, salespeople can be quite persuasive. I experienced this firsthand when I went shopping for a new couch. The moment the salesperson asked about my occupation, I instinctively knew what was coming. I work as a software engineer. And as soon as I mentioned that, the salesperson's eyes gleamed with excitement. Suddenly, they whisked me away to the high end, ridiculously expensive section of the store. YYSK The reason I'm sharing this tip with you is that salespeople often try to sell you the most expensive items based on your job title. It's their way of assuming your budget and trying to make a hefty sale. However, by disguising your job title as something less flashy, like working at a local cafe or a retail store, they will be more likely to show you affordable options that fit your actual budget. Don't let them upsell you just because of your job title save your hard-earned money for things that truly matter. Hi. I would like to buy a Lamborghini. I am assistant manager at Arby's so no upselling please. Or you could tell them you're fine just looking around the store by yourself then let know what you want when you're done. Why I tended to dress down when buying a big ticket item. Don't let them know just how much you you might find the price. Exactly matches the amount in your pocket. What has this sub become? Or just don't lie and stand firm on what you want and are willing to pay. Op. This is awful. You have the power to control what you're being sold. If you knew what was coming. Why did you allow it to happen? I knew folks would think I had money. So instead of asking why it matters. I told them that I have a good job. I don't understand why I got treated differently. You know what the easiest answer is. I don't want to talk about my job right now. You ain't there to make friends. You're there to find a damn couch find out what my job is if I decide to do financing. High paying job title. They wouldn't know my job title. It's none of their business. If I'm physically at a location to shop, it's 99.95 likely that I have already done exhaustive research. Know exactly what I want and can afford and if needed have financing lined up already. And know they have it there. I have no need for a salesperson to help unless the item I'm after requires an associate salesperson to physically hand it to me. I'm an electronics salesman. Your job title won't change what I suggest to you. What you tell me you need the product to do will change what I suggest to you. Just tell me what you need your product to do. And I'll tell you the one that will do what you need the best. And suggest things that may make your experience better. If what you need turns out to be expensive. That's just how it goes sometimes. I've worked in sales for years. What kind of bullshit advice is this? Like you walk into my store straight lying. Especially if you're going to do a credit application. Ain't got time for that. Who cares by what you want or don't? I don't need false info going on my credit apps. No need to lie about it. That shit will get you the door real quick. What is wrong with this sub? Anyone who has ever worked in sales before knows the lower job titles are the ones who buy the high margin useless stuff. People who are easily manipulated aren't going to make it that high up the corporate ladder. A furniture store makes most of their money on the financing so you actually want people who can't afford the furniture. Software engineer isn't even a high-paying position. It averages $115,000 a year. That isn't a high-end furniture salary by any stretch. Humble brag.
Most people can afford most things they're just smart enough to save. He didn't think you were rich, he thought you were stupid. What skull? Preposterous. The key phrase in this post is used to sell. This scenario is not accurate unless you bumble into the worst salesperson in the world who likes being fired for discrimination. Some of the wealthiest people I've dealt with wear the cheapest clothing and look disheveled. They also never buy any upgrades. Every person who comes into my store gets greeted immediately and gets the exact same treatment from start to finish as everyone else, regardless of their appearance. This should read why SK salespeople only ask questions to get tools to close you. Don't give them any information outside of what you want. Source been in sales my whole life. Rule 1. Always be closing. This is just so stupid. You think this is wisdom worth imparting to the world? NVM that. It is nobody's business to ask you what do you do for work unless it's the government authorities. Bank. What does my profession have to do with picking a couch? They can know my title all they want. If I'm looking for a $500 chair, I'm getting a $500 chair. They aren't going to talk me into spending $5,000. This is a stupid post. You should know that as a salesperson I will show pretty much anyone the most expensive stuff first. It's easier to go down in price than up. What if a salesperson was just straight up? Look I make commission and this is how I get paid if you ever looking and know what you want or need call me and I'll try and hook you up. Or just communicate to them that you are looking for cheaper options. I don't think I've ever been asked my occupation by any salesperson. So must be a per country thing. Or just tell them I don't care how much I make. I'm not spending more than X on this car. Here are my terms period. Say with superior smirk. Oh, I don't work. Dress like a bum to buy things like cars and furniture. And dress up to go to the bank for a loan or court. Everything else is negotiable. Experienced this first hand last week. I've recently been looking into replacing my heat AC with a heat pump and have had a few contractors come out to quote me. Three of the companies. The sales guy was very quick and quoted me between 1620k. The last company. The guy was super nosy asking about what I did for work. Hobbies. Etc. He ended up quoting me for a $35,000 system that had less capacity than the other quotes. I use the exact opposite of this. I'm a teacher. Or you can know your own budget and not just follow them around like a dog. My what now? By salespeople can be quite persuasive I'm assuming you meant to write salespeople can be pushy. And quite slimy. I've always thought asking someone what they did for a living was a little too familiar for a random initial encounter. It's basically just asking them what tax bracket to file them under in your mind. People who love their jobs are happy to tell you what they've been working on lately. The rest who just show up for the paycheck probably don't want to talk about work or think about and talk about financial situations. It is literally their job to upsell. That's a good point. I work for a company that has both corporate and customer service level jobs but most people would associate the company with the low end so when I simply say I work for X, they assume it's the low end and I don't get this treatment. Lol you can also just not be so easily persuaded that you'll buy whatever a salesman pushes at you. Which seems simpler. What's the difference between a $500 couch and $5,000 couch? $4,500.